going on YouTube? It's your boy Jay. Welcome to another gameplay. And this time, I'm going to give you a tip on how to gain map control during domination or either um, trying to find those easy kills instead of just running around the middle of the map and um, getting killed and stuff. So, uh, this is a mid, mid game and domination on wideout. Um, pretty big map. Not that good to play domination in um competitively or just it's just not that fun to play and uh it's a struggle for me also i'm not even gonna lie and i'm not really sure how i could give you this tip on this type of map basically but um i could definitely tell you guys some tips on any map that's either big or a map in which you could get away from those um killing spots in which you could just die easily and everything so basically what i'm doing right now is most mostly i'm running around on the side of the map flanking around on the corners instead of running exactly in the middle sometimes i do it in which i need to rush and get some kills to come back but obviously this map this match we just de completely destroyed these kids um my team which is perfect and getting those caps, but their killing wasn't that great. I was the main person that got all the kills, basically. So that was one thing I did as a good role. And if you're a person like an AR person or SMG person like I am, you should be wanting to have that type of quickness and um, unli unli uh, unlimited sprint. <laughs> I'm sorry, unlimited sprint to run around those maps and try to get those kills and in, in order for them to not have map control or control over other flag flags so what i'm doing right now you can see i keep on rotating around the map side on the corners and stuff and that's how i'm getting some easy kills and um doing what i have to do but obviously you have to watch your back and so just in case nobody will kill you like that dude just did a while ago and just stabbed me in my back so basically what you have to do is if you're a person that is a slayer or even a objective player that want that wants to quickly go to the to the um, cap or to the flag I should say and make those the other enemy to get off that flag and so they won't take control over it you will need to flank around the size basically like I'm just like this is all I'm seeing to you right now. It's better for you to run around on the sides of the maps and easily look around and see who's around in the middle or you could look around and see if anybody's camping and that's a better way before the campers find you. You need to want to find the camper before the campers find you. And that's a that's a tip I'm going to give you right there. And um that's basically it for people who are getting angry because they keep on getting killed by campers or they can't really get that kind of control over flags or they couldn't get kills good enough and have a low amount of kills but die significantly and this is what you need to do and also the perks that you will need to use well what I use is ready up I believe um deadly dead silence uh, unlimited sprint and you could use agility if you're using like an AR such as a Remington or if you're using any other gun um, if you're good at it get a gun that you're good at if you want to rotate around the map and that will best benefit you in getting those kills and, um, and getting you that W for your team and so yeah it depends on which type of gun you use you don't really need to use agility that much unless you have a light gun like a vector or um a mtar or whatever so yeah and um you're probably looking at my gameplay right here like oh lance but you have a couple of kills i know that i know i got a couple of kills it's some easy stuff it's a it's a easy way to get killed if you want to rotate around the map because you have to be very careful of your surroundings because you get easily passed by a camper or you could pass by someone that's just easily around the map looking for a random person. So you have to watch it back, look around, see if anybody's around you. Especially at this type of map. 
white oak is a map in which you really need to look around because you can't really see a lot. People can really camouflage into trees and in the snow and stuff, and that's how I got killed right there. I didn't look when I tried to get that flag, but hopefully I got the neutral. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed that little tip around controlling the map, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please hit a thumbs up and share if you're enjoying the video or if you want to give other people this type of tip. And this is your boy Jay, and I'm signing out. Peace.